the ethical concerns around AI revolve around who is using the data and for what reasons. And that brings up the very important point that there has to be complete transparency and accountability of what is being done with the data, who is benefiting from the use of the data. That is the only way that we could gain societal trust. Um, if the algorithm development is being done behind closed doors within companies that we know are only after increasing revenue, then there will be this mistrust. Um, there will be hesitation in sharing the data. And what's going to happen would be the algorithms that will be developed and validated and deployed will not be representative of people who mistrust the researchers, mistrust the system. And they are the ones who are most likely to benefit from artificial intelligence. So we need to create an environment and ecosystem where trust is at the center. As I mentioned, there is complete openness and transparency and accountability of exactly how we're using the data and how that algorithms are being deployed uh, in, in healthcare. Uh, and that's where the ethicists would come in because they have come up with frameworks on how to share data, on how to perform research. And that's why I think their input is crucial in terms of designing what the system is gonna look like. So I'm calling all the doctors out there and other healthcare professionals, but it's time to start learning data science. Um, everyone should be a data scientist. The reason why we have the problems that we have now is in the past, we have been passive recipients of medical knowledge. I think that we have to be more active in terms of contributing and also uh, governing that knowledge system because we have, we have learned from past experience that there could be conflicts of interest from professional societies who are generating treatment guidelines. And to me, this calls for us being active contributors and active warden of the knowledge system. And that means that we need to brush up on statistics. We need to brush up on data science so that we are able to contribute. Otherwise, if we rely on other people to build the algorithms for us, chances are we're not going to, going to have products that will lead to equitable outcomes. So I think it, it, the onus is on us to educate ourselves so that we understand data science more because we're not going back to the previous century. Data is going to be increasingly be part of the way we care for a patient. And it's not just the regular amount of data that we are used to. This will be a tsunami of data. Uh, and if we're not able to work with computers on how to sift through that data, how to develop the algorithms, then you're not on the table and you're probably on the menu. Someone is gonna be taking advantage of you. So to me, the next generation of clinicians all have to be data scientists and this is also a call to medical educators uh, that they start looking into incorporating data science into their curriculum.